Good day, it's Tony Fortunato from the technology firm. Today I'm going to walk you through a little, I guess, methodology on how to go through your packets and look for missed packets. So here we go. We've got a trace file on the screen here. And you'll see there's the three pane display. So first thing I'm going to do is get rid of the bytes. We don't need the bytes at the bottom. And we're just going to keep the details and keep the list on the screen. I'm going to go to the IPv4 header and you'll see the identification number right there and this is a kind of like a sequential number given every packet so 22835 the next one is 36 and then 37 and so on and so on and so on okay uh, I want this up on my screen just so I don't have to keep looking down here so I'm gonna right click apply that as a column and there it is so you can see four five six seven eight nine forty that sort of thing just uh, be careful because it only makes sense if the source is the same once you go to the other source then obviously it will have its own numbers so as you can see here four five six seven eight nine forty and then all of a sudden forty two so we missed forty one see that and then three four five six seven eight so the other thing you can do is if you want to go look for this packet because that's the next thing is it may have come in some other order you can simply leverage the name here, right click on identification. I'm going to copy that as a filter because I'm lazy and then you can do control F for find or edit find and I could go look for that number. So if I was looking for um, in this case I can look for the, the missing again this is in hex right so you can go look for the missing number in this case it'd be 39 and you can hit find and it says no packet match that filter so that packet is not in this trace and that's it so now if we keep following this further down you'll see the first acknowledgement down here um, if I scroll all the way down to the bottom under TCP it's got a really cool little thing called SEQACK analysis and it says this is an acknowledgement to 40296 and, and 40296 guess what was the last sequential packet and there you go so just a little tip, little trick on how to how to see all that stuff. So I hope that helps. Have a good day. Bye for now.